A young girl still too emotional to talk about her mother's murder as police hunt for her killer. That girl was also shot in a hail of bullets. And tonight, she and her siblings and their grandmother are begging anyone who knows why their family has been shattered to come forward. CBS 4's Hank Tester is live for us at Miami Dade Police Headquarters in Doral with more. Hank? Well, Elliot, as you remember, this was a brutal gun down in Opelika, Miami Dade Police looking for killers and a family tonight looking for justice. Let's take a look. <laughs> a family grieves, bands together. Please, y'all, just feel our pain. If y'all was in, in my shoes, if I know anything, I would step up. It's been four days since 33-year-old Quantia Curry Golden was shot and killed. Mother of three and three months pregnant. She had just renewed her marriage vows. Also shot her 13-year-old daughter. She's going to be okay. Mom and daughter, victims of a drive-by. This day, a family plea. But it's not easy for a daughter who was shot and lost her mother. I just want to help man who killed my mama. Monday night, Opalaka. Quantia Curry Golden sitting in a car with her daughter when the drive-by went down. Family members do not know of a motive, says Quantia's mother. My baby is gone for absolutely nothing, you know? No reason at all? No reason at all. No she beef, did. no nothing? No beef. No beef, no reason. Just heartbreak for a 13-year-old who lost her mom and now clings to her grandmother. I just feel sad. Okay, my mom is gone. <laughs> How is she doing, Grandma? She's doing great, but the only thing, whenever she talks about her mother, she gets emotional. Well, Miami-Dade police looking for two individuals, no descriptions. But if you have information, somebody's out there talking about this. 305-471-TIPS, that's Crime Stoppers. I'm Hank Chester, CBS 4 News. Back to you.